name is Jessie Lebov, and I teach over in the Slavic Department in Haggerty Hall. I have the honor and the privilege to participate in the judging of this, con of this particular contest. And I can say that it was a, an amazing experience um, to look at these three binders full of photos, uh, people, places, transportation. And I'll just tell you a few things that I, I noticed across the group that I found interesting. Uh, one is that this collection really speaks to the internationalism, of course, of Ohio State, but in two ways. One is the obvious way that our students and uh, other people, faculty, people associated with the university, they do travel abroad and see things, and we see images from that. But we also see, in many cases, um, that our community comes from abroad. That's not just internationalism, that's the globalism of our university. So you'll see not just travelers going somewhere, seeing something for the first time, you'll also see people documenting where they're from. And those are different kinds of photographs. I found that really fascinating. I didn't know necessarily that we had people in all those corners of the world coming to OSU. So that was one thing that I found really amazing. Another one that you'll see across a couple of um, different images here, in particular, there's a photograph called A Pinnacle of Change, um, one which I'm going to mispronounce called Gaia Goyim, and uh, another one called Build for Faith, which all show kind of a, an old motif, the traditional, next to the universal. But in interesting ways, what happens is you have someone documenting simply where they are, and what happens is in the background, behind them, almost accidentally, you see what is new, what is coming. You see modernity, you see globalism, whatever you want to call it. You see some confrontation with a larger world than that particular image would traditionally speak to. So I found that as well. Again, you have that very local moment that's being photographed, and the backdrop, which shows what's behind, what's coming, what's coming next. One kind of photograph, and this is one you usually see in kind of a citizen journalism moment, is just really reportage. You know, it's, it's a great photograph because that person was there at the right time, happened to have their camera or their phone, and happened to take that picture. And you, you're interested in that photograph because you get to see something you wouldn't have had seen otherwise. And then there's another kind of photograph, and I think that's what these here in this selection really show you, which has that element to it but also capture something about that photographer's experience, about what it meant for them to be there, and the impact that that photograph had on them, that experience. And also then, it translates to us here now looking at it. 